Hi, this is John at Apollo Sprayers. Today we're going to talk about what happens when the air is leaking from between the air valve stem and the needle itself. This is an easy fix, so let's get started. Sometimes the air can leak from between the air valve stem and the needle itself. This is a very easy fix. To, to uh, repair it, all we need to do is remove the back end of the gun. So we're going to take out the adjustment screw, the needle return spring, pull the trigger, remove the needle. Then take your tool, loosen off the bushing. Pull the spring out and remove the air valve. So the seals that we need to look at are actually located in the back of the adjusting nut here. There's two seals back there, so use the screwdriver end of your wrench to pry those out and they come out pretty easily. So the one seal is a harder plastic, that's the one that goes on the top, it's really just a holding seal. It's not really a seal itself and it's made of Delrin. The real seal that's doing all the work here is this rounded seal which is made of Teflon and that's what's sealing against the air valve. So if you want to test this, you can slide the Teflon seal over the air valve itself, over the stem, and make sure you have a nice tight fit on there. If it's nice and tight, then you won't have any air leaking from between uh, the air needle and the air valve stem itself. But uh, if it is leaking air through there, then you want to go ahead and replace that Teflon seal. So to reassemble it, we just put the seal, the new seal back in place, take the Delrin, seal and push that back in on top and make sure it snaps in and it's all so I usually use the valve stem just to push it down to make sure that the seals are all nice and flat in there and we're going to go ahead and reassemble the gun so put the air valve back in the gun insert the spring with the small end down then the adjustment bushing Snag that up with the wrench, then insert your needle, the spring, and finally the adjustment knob. And finally, you'll want to just hook it up to your turbine and make sure that you have no air leaking out through that stem anymore. Thanks for watching.